from my heart and from my hand Why don't people understand my intention? What's up, everybody? Welcome to Glass Cam Bottle Beer Reviews. Back from Columbus, Ohio. Had a great time there. Uh, check out the video on Clipboard. Uh, Frappa IPA. I had it the the brewery, um, not the actual brewery, but the, the, their um, brewery, brewing kitchen area in there in Columbus. I'll tell you, probably, I mean, it's, it's right up there, the best lactose sugar IPA I've ever had, and that's like my, my thing right now. So I was super stoked on that what i got though is don't tell mike this is a uh, collab with hoof hearted and stillwater artisanal elves so that's that uh got like a kenny loggins or somebody who knows on there plus you got chet uh, my buddy courtney pointed that out he's right that's when um Weird science when the older brother Chet turns into the monster. Pretty freaking cool. 9.2%. This thing's a double IPA, of course. Uh, brew with Pinoy. Pinoy, I say. <laughs> um, Pinoy Nor juice and hibiscus. I, I, for some reason, I have the hardest time pronouncing that. Basically, it's a red grape. It's like a um, red wine. Okay. Um, love some hibiscus drank a, quite a few of these my my boy King K Dustin when we we're hanging out in Columbus I mean it's got that funk funkadelic man it is funky as all funky junky danky stanky get get out on this thing um, you can definitely see the the color the hibiscus with the um, gray grapes the nor uh, grapes there you can definitely see that color it makes it a little murkier it's, it's really murky for that kind of compare it to lady bros night out with um, veil but it wasn't that murky so but it smells like a melon definitely cantaloupe melon hibiscus grapey with that funky stinky danky in it that's that sweat sock dank oh it's so good let's give it a taste wow and it, it has a nice creamy mouthfeel to it too really nice nice mouthfeel to it um it's just really smooth don't taste any of the alcohol whatsoever i mean you would think this thing was six percent five six percent wouldn't know that now when it is warmer and also out of the can you can taste more of the alcohol of course but in the glass it's unbelievable really nice white tight bubbles on it like i said just melon um, I like melon rind with that bitterness at the end. You can taste that hibiscus. This, uh, well, I guess it's the grape, the bitter grape. You know, uh, like a unripe grape doing that bitterness. Wonderful figure, freaking beer. <clears throat> I'm giving it like a 9.7. I mean, that's how much I, I enjoyed this beer. I know it did. Most of their stuff sells out. This one didn't sell out. The brewery on the release. I don't know why why probably because it's a collab a lot of times their collabs don't do as well as their some of their own stuff but 9.7 great beer uh, don't tell Mike appreciate you watching thank you